Welcome back to our Japan series. It's our final day in Kyoto, and we've fallen in love with the city's contrasting landscapes, tried super tasty sweets, and even learned how to make a notebook in the traditional Japanese way. In this episode, we'll be visiting two more epic spots you must see in Kyoto and showing you around the traditional Japanese house we stayed in in Fushimi Inari. But first, lunch. Lunch was amazing. I think, so good. I think it's called kaiseki, like many dishes, a meal. And now we're walking to the Golden Pavilion. It's our last stop before we head on to Fushimi Inari. Yay! As we headed to Kinkankuji, we stumbled upon Hirano Jinja. This is one of the best places to see cherry blossoms in spring. And there's even an annual cherry blossom festival. We were here during autumn, so we saw trees full of mandarins instead. The Golden Pavilion is just 10 minutes away and is absolute heaven for autumn girlies like me. Just look at this entrance, oh my gosh. This is one of the most popular places in Kyoto, so expect to see crowds. You also need to pay 400 yen to visit, and the tickets look like this. This is amazing. Once you're in, this is the amazing view you get. This is one of the most impressive temples we saw in Japan. The way it shines when the sun hits and the way the water reflects on the gold leaf is just stunning. Kinkakuji has actually burned down several times, most recently in 1950, when it was set on fire by a fanatic monk. So this is a beautiful replica of the original structure. If you look at it closely, you'll notice each floor is different. That's because it combines three different styles of architecture, Shinden, Samurai and Zen. The design itself represents the harmony between heaven and earth. It's such a beautiful building, you can stare at it for ages. And just so you don't get disappointed, no one is allowed inside the temple. While you're here, you should try a matcha ice cream with gold leaf on top. Mm. It matches my mask. <laughs> Everybody's choking <laughs> because it has powder, matcha powder, <laughs> and it goes in the throat. <laughs> oh, is she? <laughs> Then we got on a bus and headed to the city center to buy a carry-on at Don Quixote because we were carrying way too much weight. And then we headed down to Inari, got lost in the dark, and finally found the amazing place we would stay for the next two nights. Welcome to our traditional Japanese house in Fushimi Inari. Let's see this one. What's this? Oh, it's the room. The main bedroom is here. Where is it? Yes. Look. Oh Tatami floors. Look at the floors. Oh, Tatami beautiful. floors. It's gorgeous. I think you have and a view to the garden, I think. But that's yes. amazing. Storage space. It's more storage? It's a little share. Nice. It's, it's gorgeous. No, what we have in here on this side. No. Oh, it's our like dining area. Yes. It's beautiful. We've got some tea. Some tea. This is the main living room area and dining area. 
kitchen. Look at this massive sink. It's so big. <laughs> it is. Main toilet. And you've got some toilet shoes as well. Mm -hmm. Massage there really cool. with view to the garden. Although I cannot see any garden at the moment. Oh, they have toys in a little row for kids, which is very sweet. They do, let me see. Look. And the row is so nice. Oh, that is cute. Yeah. Actually. It is really cute. <laughs> yes, Double right. sink. Oh my god, have you seen the sink? Oh. Look, look. Oh, wow. Are you kidding me? Look how cute that sink is. That's adorable, honestly. How amazing is this? And this is the main feature of the house. I believe I'm doing the right thing. <laughs> yeah, you are. Welcome to another beautiful morning in Kyoto. It's 6.54 a.m. Yeah, we woke up too late today. Too late. Just took us a bit longer to leave the house today. Because we are a bit tired. Yes. A bit. A little bit. Look at the bamboo forest. I love Japan. We're heading to Fushiminari. See you there. Fushimi Naritaisha is one of the most important Shinto shrines in Kyoto. It's also one of the oldest. It is dedicated to Fushimi Naritaisha, the god of rice, sake and prosperity, and is one of the most famous places in Japan. The first thing we noticed when we got here was that the Tori gates are actually dark orange and some of them look older than the others. Each of these Tori gates was donated by someone who wished for good luck and their name is inscribed in black ink on the back of each gate. If you have time, you should definitely hike up Mount Inari. Unfortunately, we didn't have enough time or stamina left to do that, but hey, at least we saw it without crowds. There are loads of small shrines throughout the trail and, apparently, aggressive monkeys and boars, so be careful. This is one of the must-see places in Kyoto, and Japan in general, so do try to take half a day to explore it properly. We regret not spending as much time as we wanted here, and can't wait to come back and see more of the area. Hi, mister. Konnichiwa. He does not give a shit about you. <laughs> Fighting with the monkeys. Seven Eleven Hall. We can't control ourselves, but I mean, Ooh, look, at look at this thing. thing. Honestly, this is like a Kinder Egg, but with kawaii characters. I hope so. I hope so, at <laughs> least for the price that I paid for it. <laughs> Her Atlas, I bought this because of you. Okay, guys, so we're gonna try this chocolate with something inside, I hope. <laughs> so cute! Otherwise, we want this just for the cute packaging. I, we'll indeed. <laughs> okay, let's open let's it. See, let's see. It looks like a kinder egg. Cute. Yeah. Nice. It's like a kinder egg. There you go. Okay, it's happening. It's happening, guys. Laying. It's happening. Okay, like a kinder Yay. egg. Yay! Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh, it's Japanese kinder egg. Guys, we have found it. Be cute, be cute. Be cute, be cute. <gasps> oh. oh my god, cute. Okay, so it's got an old fish. A fish? Yes. Yes, one second. 
Let me try to. Okay, so this goes in here, like that. <laughs> and then let me see. Yeah, 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 exactly. Like this. Oh, the chocolate smells good. It goes like this. No, like like this, like this, like this. He's holding a fish. Mm -hmm. He's holding a tiny little fish. Why does he look a bit sad? He's cute. Oh. <laughs> Can you see it? Yes. So cute. There you go. <laughs> there you go, guys. Love it. A Japanese Kinder Egg. What about the chocolate? Is it as good as the Kinder one? Mm, I don't know. That's what I want. Look, he's about here. Crunchy chocolate with strawberries. Oh! They <laughs> smell amazing. Mmm, they smell so good. They literally look like the ones in the in the picture. Mm-hmm. That's right. Mmm. Oh my god. It's delicious. Honestly, 7 Eleven, man. 7 Eleven. You really know what to make that thing, honestly. So cute. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I wanted the Neko. Mm -hmm. I didn't get the Neko. We're gonna try the white chocolate rusks. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. It's like tiny slices of bread covered in much like this. Like for real. Is it a bread? Yes, and it's stuffed like a like a but, um, like a toast, right? Mm. Is it good? Oh it's my! It's a toast covered with white chocolate. Mmm. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. That's good white chocolate. Mm. Mm -hmm. I like it. That's amazing. Mm. Amazing. More cute packaging. Adorable. Mmm. Mmm. What is it? So good. Lemon? Yep. Pineapple. Pineapple. Mm. Very good. Mm. Good candy. We're back from the shower. Now I'm gonna try the peach souffle. Oh, yeah. And these cute little Kit Kats. These are gold. These are like gold, milk, and gold. I don't know, we're just eating gold. It's the second time we're eating yeah. gold today. And I also opened this pizza flavored potato chips. Oh Let's yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and the jewel here. I think it's gonna be this one. Which I is. I think so. Along the chat. Along the chat. Along the chat. Along the chat. <laughs> White chocolate. <laughs> Let's start with the savory first. Mm hmm. So, they're okay. Show me. I want to say pizza flavor, that was right. <laughs> Tomato or something. Mm, that kind of tastes like a pizza. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, like a, a margarita. Mm. They're good. Mm. I like them. The more I eat them, the more I like them. <laughs> so. Oh my god, they look amazing. Are they actually gold? Show yeah, me. Look, they look like this. Oh, that is not gold. Are they supposed to? Oh, they're silver. Silver. Right? Oh, what does it say in here? I don't know. Meh. Nah, it's alright. Mm hmm. Just do a sneak thing. It's not bad. Any good? I'm gonna steal it. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. That is very good indeed. Mmm. The white chocolate is so the good. No, is don't have any more. I got half of it. I'm having the last one. Everything is a shower. So if it's too cold for you to have a shower outside, this is all part of the bathroom. That's the door to the garden with the outdoor shower. And there you go, bathroom. This tea room though is so cute. And now upstairs actually, because I forgot to show you. This house is so big. 
that I don't even know the way upstairs. What? Um, Babs? How the fuck do I go upstairs? So, we go up the stairs. They're not great for people with low mobility, but as you can see, they're quite, I can't remember the word. And in here, we've got a tatami room. And we've got another room, which is empty right now. But if you brought more people in, you've got loads of beds here. Three other people fit in here. So cute. And then you've got another toilet. And the sink. Which is just as stunning as the downstairs one. Honestly, this house is a freaking dream. Struggling. <laughs> now we're going to enjoy the outdoor bath and relax. Oh, I just want to cook in those 50 degrees. <laughs> we'll see you tomorrow in Hiroshima. We'll grab some food. Andrea is hungry. Also, they gave us this really. Hmm? Oh, one second, off, yeah, the tap. Just one second. The usual. That's how you do. You're always doing something about. <laughs> I can't. I, I honestly. You can now do the work. Just went past. I'm sorry. <laughs> I swear to God. Thank you. <laughs> They're more like blood orange. Blood orange? She's so pretentious. Shut up, it's red. So, no head? So, no head? <laughs> <laughs>